more for the game. Come, Sid. You have passed the Thirteen Gates. And you come to my table to play the game of life and death. Your stake is wagered. I refuse none who come here. Yet, I say, turn back. The game begins. One lives and one dies. Let us see what you are made of. Here is the first member of my court. The Jack of Dust. Twelve in all must fall before you may challenge me. Let the cards fall where they may. We begin. That first moment, that glinting weapon, the call to action, to adventure, truly, there is nothing like it. Choose from these options. moment to savor. That will make you much more effective. I was never a fan of illusion or pretense. Here I'll make an exception. You can now reflect your opponent's ranged attacks using your shield. Make good use of this. Fair Merith. I'm not surprised to find that this encounter remains vivid in your memories.
I'm sure you are grateful for that. Bound once more, seeking the heart of it all. You are on the final floor of our simple map. Your opponent waits here for you. Find him. If you defeat me, well, it is early to be talking about victories and losses. Let us see what you're made of. I'm sure it's not called Dead Man's Gorge without reason. You can now counter your opponent's attacks. Hit the counter button when you see the flashing indicator. Peasant's weapon, but effective nonetheless. Really? Is that what you're going to do? If you were wondering why you've been collecting all that gold, you now have your answer. We're starting to get into the meat of the game now. The back and forth between resources and rewards. A classical approach to dealing with crowds. Artifacts provide powerful special abilities to use in combat, but it takes time to ready them. What did you think would happen with a card called Ambush, eh? Ah! <laughs> 
I cannot expect you to get by without some protection. A little extra health, but it is only a momentary respite. You have reached my first champion. A good man, driven to madness by a war that took all from him. Wife and child, kith and kin. From such dark and brittle iron, I forge my tools. Now we see your metal. This token will unlock more cards if you can defeat this encounter. Some enemy attacks cannot be blocked or countered. Get out of the way or stop them with your own counterattack. <laughs> to the worms with him. Perhaps there is peace for him in the grave, poor soul. One champion has been sent to the cabinet. Yet we are only at the start of our road. You will face 11 more opponents who will test your strength, your memories, and your resolve. Few fall at the first hurdle. None reach the last. We have wagered, and you have won. You may claim your rewards, yet I will also claim mine. As you improve, so do I. Balance must be retained. again. Ah, good. Now you understand the basics, we can begin in earnest. Your hero is returned to his beginning items. Our decks are reset. Welcome to the cabinet, home of the members of my court.
a quick glimpse at things to come. Time for you to face my undead army. Meet the Jack of Skulls. New content awaits you. It will be awarded when you complete your run. I will add my own cards to the deck. How boring life would be without a little spice. We play for life and death. Prepare yourself. Given how rarely one encounters the folk, you are fortunate indeed to meet Merith again. Or perhaps we are merely cycling around the wheel and dipping into the same memories time and time again. I'm sure you are grateful for that. It lives in every game. That initial moment where things begin. I have worked on these cards all my days, and the canyon has been there from the outset. Running water protects against many things in myth. Generally, though, it's just a pain to get past. There's a token in it for you if you win. The token is yours. Well done. Head downwards, if you dare. Many have reached this far. Further, in fact. I do not know if you have what it takes to do better than they did. I always thought it was best to avoid the problems of others. I see you have no such concerns. It's a lump of iron on a stick. Not terribly subtle. Are you sure that's the right approach?
A shield for the marathon, not the sprint. Distinctly average. What do you expect me to say? Congratulations. Armor protects you from damage. The best armor, of course, does so much more. I'm starting to wonder if you're simply leaving this card in as a quick way to get your hands on a shield. towards our foe. Good. Now all you need to do is find and kill the Jack of Skulls and we can progress. Excellent way to turn an injury into an asset. Greed. If it were not for greed, then who would play at this game?
chains for armor, as you will. I like this demon. He lies as often as he tells the truth. Win this and claim my token. I'm impressed. Few select these sorts of weapons because nobody ever anticipates being in peril. Such misplaced confidence is usually their downfall. Again, the surprise attack. The novelty must wear thin on subsequent travels. Artifacts give you powerful abilities to use in combat. The Undead. Of all the players in the game, these are the most dangerous in the world. 
yet in no natural form. A wrongness, an error, cheating. Shots from rifles cannot be deflected. You would do better to avoid them. Are you agile enough? Well done indeed, but you have roused the dead in their dusty tombs, and even I cannot say what will come of it. Now our wager becomes more interesting. Will the tools you've earned suffice to address the challenges I pose? That is the question, is it not? Shall we deal again? <laughs> 